Hi, I'm Daniel Mole. What was it like uh, growing up with autism? Well, to me, it was normal. I've lived a normal lifehood. Um, but to other people, it might seem I was crazy and different. When were you recognised uh, that you have autism? I was recognised at 18 at Leicester College uh, uh, while stu studying in catering. If you were recognised earlier, would you think this would help? I think it would. Because um, if I was recognised earlier, I'd be able to know some of the signs now and that it wouldn't uh, have caused as much stress on my parents. What symptoms do you think that, that you have that are related to autism? Well, I may not have all the symptoms with autism, but I do have uh, most of them that I've been given on this list. Right, if I gave you this list, uh, which uh, of these symptoms do you have? May avoid eye contact, I have that sometimes. I think it's just the giggling. <laughs> Being, prefer to be alone. I do enjoy alone time. Difficulty interacting with others sometimes. And spinning objects, playing with stuff, I can't stop. If there was a pen on the table, I'd have to pick it up and play with it, definitely. In America, one in 68 people have autism. Whilst in the UK, it's uh, more than one in a hundred people that will have autism. And it's five times more likely yeah, that boys will have autism. <laughs> How does it affect you in everyday life? Well, looking through the symptoms, it depends, it can be really bad, but other days it can be, I don't even notice it at all. For me, some of the symptoms affect me daily, like having to do the same thing all the time. And um, also appropriate, inappropriate giggling or laughing. I went to a funeral once and I was laughing my head off. <laughs> Autism hasn't defined me. It is just part of me. It didn't change who I was uh, when I was recognised, it's just helped me to understand.